Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video, I'm gonna show how to create mysterious hunting portraits. I've put a sheet of plexiglass in front of my model and covered it with aloe gel. I've seen people use Vaseline for similar effect, but I find aloe gel works better. It is less messy and also easier to clean. For the camera, I'm using Pentax 6.7 with 105 lens. Also, I put black promised filter on my lens. For the film, I went with Lomography 800 and metered it at 800. I just like Lomo 800 in general and use it a lot. This is Brianna, she's an actress and she was awesome to work with. I'm gonna link her Instagram below this video, so check her out. Now let's talk about the light. I've put the light behind the glass to avoid unwanted glare on the glass. And since it was set way above the model's face, I've asked her to lift her chin up so the light on her face would look more flattering. Also, I've been shooting a little bit off center because I didn't want to see my own reflection in the glass. For the light, I'm using RGB one that I got for very cheap of AliExpress a year ago or so. I've got two of these and to be honest, they are pretty beaten up. I've dropped them so many times, I've shot with them in the rain and they still work. They charge from USB and I didn't have any situation when the light suddenly died on a shoot and I wasn't able to finish it. They probably would not hold full day of continuous shooting, but for a couple of hours of taking photos, they are more than enough. Also, they do look good on the videos and they don't flicker, which is a big plus for LED lights. Here we switched the position of the light and put it on the side. But it was still behind the glass, facing the glass just a little bit, so I don't get glares on the glass. This is Jeffrey, he's also a photographer and he helped me to film these behind the scenes and assisted with light. I'm gonna link his Instagram below, so check his work. I've taken some digital shots as well, and for that I've used Sony A7R2 with Helios lens. I like using Helios on my digital camera because it softens the image and also I find it easier to focus when I have to focus manually. At the end, I played with lone exposure portraits and came up with some abstract images. A little piece of advice, don't trust the stickers on the film rolls, because sometimes they tend to not hold well and your film can be accidentally exposed. That's why I always carry a scotch tape that I can use for film. 